I'm Patty Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at pattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is climate change and a blizzard. I'm going to start down here on the bottom left corner and I'm going to draw a curved line all the way up and over and stop and I'm going to come back down to the bottom and I'm going to draw that same curved line all the way up and off the page. I now come over to the lower right hand corner and I'm going to draw a curved line up off the page and I'm going to draw it one more time down and up curve line off the page now I don't want to forget what I'm drawing so up here I'm going to write blizzard and a blizzard is a winter storm with long lasting strong winds and intense snowfall and this is something that was really brought to light this last winter. So I'm going to do a straight line up, curve line, straight line down, come about top part, I'm going to do a straight line up, curve line, straight line down, and then I'm going to start way over here on the left and I'm going to put a straight line up and a curve line, a little straight line down, okay? I'm going to come back down to the bottom on the left and I'm just going to go curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. I'm going to come up to the center and I'm going to go curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. And one more at the top, big curve line, curve line, curve line, connect. Right at this, oh, let's do one more, sorry, curve line, curve line, curve line. Okay, now right here in this section, we're going to put straight line, straight line, straight line, cross. 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 We're going to fill this section in with all of these straight line, straight line, straight line, cross. Okay? All right. Now, this section right here, we're going to start at the bottom and move all the way up. So I'm going to put a dot right here at the bottom, and I'm going to go kind of a round line up, down, in, down, up, connect. And then I'm going to do an overlap shape on it. So I'm going to do a curve line, straight line, curve line, curve line, curve line straight line connect and then on this side on the right hand side I'm going to go straight line out straight line down curve line curve line curve line connect on this section on the left I draw a curve line and a little baby circle inside and on the right hand side I'm going to draw a curve line little baby circle inside this I'm just going to put one two baby circles. Now I move up to the next section and I'm going to go slightly curve line up, straight line, curve line, come back down to the bottom, little curve line, little curve line, straight line up, connect, and I'm going to put one curve line at the bottom, one curve line at the top, and I'm going to put a baby circle and a baby circle. Now underneath, or really connecting to this, right here on the right hand side, I'm going to go slightly curve line up, straight line down. Curve line, straight line, curve line, up, connect. Right here at the bottom I do my curve line, curve line, baby circle, baby circle. Now I come up a little bit further. Now I'm going to draw straight line, straight line, curve line up, curve line over, down, 
can add. But right here I'm going to put curve line, baby circle, curve line, baby circle. Now, right here at this point, I'm going to go straight line up, straight line out, curve line in, curve line, curve line down, straight line up, connect, and right here I put a curve line in a baby circle and a curve line in a baby circle. Right hooked onto this, I'm going to put a curve line up, curve line out, straight line, straight line out, straight line over, connect, and I'm going to put a baby circle, whoops, I'm sorry, curve line and a baby circle and a little one if you can fit a curve line. And right here at the very top, we're going to go straight line down, straight line off the page, come down below, straight line off the page, and if you have room, curve line, curve line, baby circle, baby circle. Okay. What's going on here? When I see on TV, on the news, they'll say a winter storm has hit. And they undoubtedly show a freeway that has had a major collision with all of these cars crashed into each other because of what they call a white out. You cannot see in front of you and therefore these cars crash into each other. But what really surprised me this past winter was that they had avalanches that went over the freeway with all of this snow and because everybody has cameras they caught it and I was like oh my goodness what an excellent example of climate change. We would have storms, but not like we do now. These are very extreme. Okay, so right now what we're going to do is let's see how we're going to color this in. Okay, you want to use a blue crayon and you just want to kind of go over. Now this, these are supposed to be action lines that are showing the movement of the snow in the blizzard as it's hitting the freeway. So every once in a while, I'm just going to put some straight lines because this is all snow, okay? All snow. Then, I'm going to leave the rest of this alone because it's all whited out. Then, you can kind of have fun with your cars that are all crashed and on top of each other. So I just went through my crayon box and picked all the colors I could and made my colors, my crayons, all be used so that you could see the, the cars crashed without losing the look of them all being thrown together. So I did mine all in different colors and that's up to you. Those are your choices. But I wanted to make sure that they stood out. And then the one constant with all of it, with all these overturned vehicles, are all the black tires. So just make sure you make all your tires on your freeway in the whiteout, in the middle of a blizzard with an avalanche coming down on you. Make sure you do all your tires black. Now, the last thing that I did was I took my gray and I lightly did a loop-de-loop -loop line all the way up, over, and on top for the asphalt. And I use gray because it's whited out also. All right, let's see what this all looks like colored in. Okay, here's my blizzard with my crashed cars in my winter storm in my whiteout with an avalanche coming over any minute. Um, and this is a good example of climate change. Extreme weather. Okay, bye-bye.